I'm a precision engineer. I run a small engineering business in Bristol producing brake molds. Um, ever since I was a kid, I've dreamt about flying, and especially electric aviation. Uh, so, a few years ago, I converted this petrol engine helicopter, a very large scale one, to electric to see if it could be done. Uh, having successfully done that, I then moved on to my next project, which was producing my electric power motor. Okay, well, this is uh, our prototype. Uh, did, uh, we designed about a year ago. Um, so, how, how long does it fly at the moment? Uh, it's flying for about 20 minutes at the moment. It varies on the conditions. Um, 30 minutes we think is quite achievable, possibly even longer. And, and the charge time, what, how, what's that like? Uh, two hours at the moment, one hour is easily achievable. It's just we have no need to charge it that fast at the moment. Right. So, um, what does the unit weigh? Uh, the unit is weighing 20 kilos, including the batteries, uh, which is generally 5 to 10 kilos lighter than the battery. Roughly how much is it going to cost to run the machine? Uh, running costs are, in electricity, about 10 pence per flight of approximately 20 to 30 minutes. Uh, however, batteries do deteriorate, probably 300 cycles, so in real terms the cost is about 3 to 4 pounds per flight, which is very comparable to a petrol engine machine. If you can get this into production, what sort of cost do you think it's going to retail at? Uh, we're thinking that 3,000 pounds retail price is, is fairly achievable. It is just a prototype. And we'd like to take it into a commercial sort of status, but we need to raise the revenue to do that, which is going to be somewhere between fifteen and hundred thousand pounds, which we're hoping to do by setting up a company uh, and then selling shares in that company for so three hundred pounds. Private each. investors can get on board at, at what sort of entry level? Uh, probably two hundred pounds a share, uh, which we're hoping would give a fairly good return on that money. And if they choose to buy a machine, uh, we can probably give them that money back as a discount as a shareholder. So as far as you know, it would be the only electric unit in uh, production in the UK? Yes. With so foreign UK support for UK pilots? Exactly. Excellent. Thanks. Thanks, Neil. Thank you.